welcome to my channel like I'm so behind on YouTube I don't even know if people say that anymore probably not anyways what's up y'all today's video I'm gonna be doing a princess Paul for today's video, I'm going to be doing a Princess Polly try-on haul. This is not sponsored, and no, they did not send me any of these items. And no, I don't have a discount code. Why? I don't know. I don't know. If you literally Google Princess Polly discount code, or like, if you go to their tagged photos, every single girl that posts a photo, like, is like, use my code, whatever, 20, 20% 20 off. So, like, a million people have codes. It's just not me. I don't have a code, because... But that's okay. That's okay. I did like a mini haul of this on my TikTok and I posted like a few of the things But I've been recently like <laughs> getting everything I have from there and I've been selling all my old clothes Speaking of which shot my Poshmark I literally post stuff almost every day and I ship out orders every single day So follow it shop it and yeah buy my clothes anyways I'm moving so I'm gonna like try and get an entire new wardrobe Princess Polly is just like a lot of the in stuff It's just like what's in trend right now. They have everything that's like in style So I have been shopping there quite often so I have some stuff that I just got and I have some stuff that I got like last month. I have a lot of stuff so I'm gonna do this whole haul on it. I'm gonna try it on for you and show it to you. So I hope you like it okay? If you're new to my YouTube channel please subscribe because I post TikTok vlogs like every single day but I'm really trying to start being very consistent with my YouTube. I'm about to move into a new apartment and so I think I'll be like really like on the go with these videos so you don't want to miss any of them. Also sorry for my poor bed making skills in the background. Um I just, I don't know. I don't know where to film in this house, okay? I know it's dark back there, but just let it be. All right, enough of that. So first I'm showing y'all this little military dress that I've seen literally everyone in. I think it's just perfect for somewhere you need to be dressy or somewhere you wanna be casual because it can be dressed up or down. And they have a lot of colors to choose from, but I got blue because I wanted to get the green, but I've been buying so much green that I need to chill a little bit, you know what I'm saying? So I got the blue and I really like it a lot. I got an extra small, which is a size two, and that is not what size I usually buy. It runs big, and I'm actually kind of thinking about returning it and getting an extra, extra small. Ooh. But I don't know, like this fits perfect, but I still want to try an extra, extra small. Anyways, it just has these little ties on the bottom on the side, and I feel like it's just so like... Sexy and like professional. Yeah. I really don't know how to describe outfits, okay? If you don't have one, you gotta go get one. Okay, next I got just this little tank top with an angel on it in a size 4, US 4. I just think this is just like a cute basic crop top and I have a ton of crop tops like this, but I don't have any really with like images on them, designs, images, images. Anywho, and I've like seen people wearing this on TikTok actually. I really like this and I can tell I'm gonna wear it a lot. I think it's a little bit see-through though. I put it on the other day, but I put it on with my black bra. If I think if I just wear little sticky nips, we're good to go. So the next top, this, I literally just bought it to like have a top, whatever. Didn't know how much I love it because it's just literally like a basic plain shirt. Um, I literally have worn it more than anything else in my wardrobe. Like it's literally my go-to outfit now. All I wear is this jeans. I've worn this with shorts. I wear this top all the time. Um, this is a US 4 and I just wear it with little sticky boobies and it's just so freaking cute. Like it's so comfy, adjustable straps and I love it and it's that green color that I can't stop buying. Yeah, I love this and I've worn it a million times but have still not taken a photo in it. I just keep repeating it but then I still am not taking pictures. Don't worry, I've been spotted in it quite a few times so it's too late. I got this latent green top in a US 4. I'm obsessed with this color green but I can't, I have to stop buying it because all my tops are starting to look alike like they look the same it looks like I'm wearing the same top over and over again because I can't stop buying this color I can't stop I know this one is the one that I could not get over my body because my bust I don't have big boobaloos boobies cookies whatever you want to call them I have like a big bust like wide arms and like I could not get it past my big old head but it is so cute and I probably will get it in the bigger size maybe not though because I need to stop but maybe yeah but this would just be really cute paired with jeans or I mean you know what anything but I was thinking jeans I'm always thinking jeans okay so is this okay so next up I got this little like metallic -y gold skirt it's like satin silk I don't really know the difference I don't know I don't know my fabrics I'm not a fashion icon here okay so ordinary girl this is really cute and I am usually a US 4 but I got a 2 because just like based on the model there was no reviews because it was brand new but based on the model like it looks like it was gonna be one of those that like if you get the wrong size it's like a little baggy so I just went and sized down it fits but it's like super snug like where I got flab hanging over I definitely would be needing a size up in this but it is really cute and it's you know that booty popping yeah that's all that that's all that matters sometimes actually all the time men are crazy okay next I'm gonna show you this little scrunchy top front tie top that I got um I have not worn it yet I almost did but then I got a little nervous you definitely have to have trust in the shirt make sure you get the right size kind of like can go off the shoulder a little bit 
Excuse you, mom. No, I don't want Chinese. Yeah, I got this in a four. Um, I definitely would just wear sticky boobs on it and just pray to God that there's no wind. But it's super cute and I've seen like a million little Insta girls in this. This little bad boy right here. I love the color of it. I paired it with a tan pair of pants that I got at Forever 21 that make my butt look very flat, by the way. I just thought that was like a cute little fit to go together. It's just really fun and it's stretchy and it's got these little, I know you probably can't see, but it's got those little things that like grip to your skin almost in a way like on the sleeves which helps so that like it doesn't slide you know it, like sticks where it needs to be which is what we want okay anyways moving on did y'all see this this thing on okay next up i got this really cute top i need a lot of just like plain tops to wear with jeans and jean shorts i got this little cute flower one kind of got that like tough material and i got it in a size us4 i however am going to probably be returning it i am going to be returning it because i could not get it to fit it just felt like it was too small for me so i would definitely need to get a size up it is super super cute so i might exchange it for a size larger up it was just like around here i couldn't yeah anyways here's this really cute fun fresh if you've never filmed a try on haul you don't realize it but you really do run out of like describing words like you're like and it's cute well duh it's cute or else i wouldn't have bought it okay so next i'm gonna show you this little shirty poo poo this is just like a blue regular shirt like i said i needed a lot of tops to just like go with like my denim and stuff like that so i got this little blue one because i don't really wear a lot of blue and i need to because blue is so cute this is a yeah a size four and it's just got that same princess poly feel to it i don't know what kind of fabric they use but i feel like they use this a lot it kind of feels like the cheap fabric but it looks good and it's like a thin material so you know and this also has adjustable straps so that's really cute next i got this sabotage green skirt and it looks so weird when i opened it up i was like what is this because it looks so long but i got this in a us2 again i'm usually four but i'm glad i got it too because it's long and it's meant for you to like scrunch it up i think I'm pretty sure, I mean, let me know. I scrunched it up and it actually ended up like being really cute and it's stretchy. But once again, that booty do be popping, you know, to comment down in here. This is super cute. It ties at the bottom and I just paired it with a black top. It's like a green tie dye. Once again, I gotta stop buying green. I don't know why I'm buying green, like it's new, but I just love the color. I feel like it's very in and very chic. Look, I'm trying to think of new words to use, okay? Love this thing. Love this little hoe. So next I got this Aerosmith graphic tee and I actually really love it. I put it in my cart one time and ordered stuff and then like took it out of my cart because I was like, no. And then I ended up buying it this next time through and just got it. And I got it in a large because I like huge shirts. If I wanted to dress it, like dress it up cuter, I would have gotten a smaller size, but I got it so I could wear it just big and baggy and I just paired it with like baggy jeans. I wear t-shirts 24 seven. I'm actually like really mad I'm not in one right now. You know. <laughs> you know so yeah this is a size large and i love it the color i love i don't really have any white graphic tees i always buy color but this had pink on it you know a sucker for pink um so yeah love this graphic tee and it's super soft and stretchy which i don't like the rough t-shirts at all so that is a really good one they might be sold out of it and if they are i think just like really any of princess polly's graphic tees all are that soft material so you're good to go you're good to go i don't know why i sounded like that sorry okay so now i'm going to show you the things that i got not this previous time but the time before it's just a few things don't don't worry don't don't you click away yet don't you go anywhere so let me start off with this skater skirt so i read the reviews and saw that everyone was like oh my god it's so tiny like i might even sign up twice blah 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 so i listened to them so this is a us6 once again i'm i keep saying this but just to remind you i'm normally a four so this is when you size up on Okay, did, did, did we get that? This is just a frilly little skirt. And of course I already have like a white one. So I got a pink because it's my favorite color. And why wouldn't I get pink? I have yet to wear this yet because I haven't gone anywhere where I need to wear it. I'll definitely be wearing it on the gram soon. Don't you worry. Uh, don't you worry. This brings me back to the old rec cheerleading days. Like this is what kind of skirts that we used to wear and that. Love it. I love me a good skirt. Everyone used to make fun of me whenever I'd always wear my skirts. And now they're like in style and I'm like, what? What now, huh? That was so cringe. I'm very sorry. Just disregard that. Okay, we're almost done. We're almost done. This next beautiful number I've also not worn because it's literally 135 degrees outside in Georgia. Humidity, approximately. So I got this satin button down or silk satin. I don't freaking know. What's the difference? Is it the same thing? Okay, so this is a US, hello? This is a US 4 and I think this just styled with some like heels would be so sexy, like a little date night. Not that I go on dates. Anywho, it literally feels like, I mean, it feels like what it is. Like, so, you know how some people have been wearing like corset corsets with it? I can't speak. I really like have been tempted to buy one to wear with this. 
really love that look. I want to try it out, so maybe you'll see me do that. Maybe not. Who knows? But yeah, this is comfy, and I love it, and it's cute, and I'm like folding it like... Treating it like it's nothing, but it's something, I'll tell you that. I just had to come back because I realized I forgot an item. <laughs> I forgot this little country cowgirl shirt, okay? And I, I turned this into a little cowgirl look. It is a little bit of a just a little bit of a tough material, but it's stretchy and it ties around the back, so it can adjust it to fit you. I got a US 4 in this. I just really was living in the cowgirl moment. It kind of gives me like that like vest vibe. Is it is that what it is? Is it a vest? I don't know, but it's just like different than anything I own, so I thought it would be really fun. I forgot to show you all this freaking dress that I love. I got it in a size US 4. The material is super thin, but it is still flattering on your body. It's probably one of my favorites. I paired it with some little white heeled sandals or mules. I don't know what they are. And then a little white bag. And this would look so cute with sneakers too. Yes, mama, serving you looks very much so, yes. I can't wait to wear it. The last thing I'm gonna show you, oh, actually no, scratch that. I got two more things to show you. So I did buy these rings. Which ones did I get? Oh, these two? Excuse my nails and like, oh God. But I got just this little ring set because I've been needing rings. I lose all my rings and I just bought these thinking like, I don't know. They're literally perfect and they don't turn my fingers green and now I'm gonna keep buying more rings from Princess Polly because there was only one size and like I have really small fingers. Well, I guess I have average fingers. I don't know, but these just fit amazing and like they fit where I can switch them on different fingers too. And I'm so glad I bought them. It's so glad. <laughs> okay, final thing I'm gonna show you. Uh, sweet baby Jesus. They were buried under all my clothes that I've thrown on the floor. So. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I feel like they're like a dinosaur. <laughs> I got these big old babies. These are the Windsor Smith chunky platform sneakers. Hideous? Maybe. Do they look fashionable? Yes. But anyways, these uh, platform shoes are actually super comfortable. My other ones, like I feel like they clunk in. These ones, not so much. And like, I feel like I could like dance in these, which I did dance in a TikTok. But if I wore these around a boy, they would definitely roast me. But all men are trash, so. Ow! All I wear is white sneakers, it's pretty bad. I have like four go-to sneakers and they're all white. I think that's it for the haul. I feel like there was more stuff, but really it was a lot. I just freaking blah, 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 talk a whole lot, but. Boring. Thank y'all so much for watching this. If you like this video, make sure you like it and comment down below. Follow me on all my social medias. Follow me on Instagram. Follow me on TikTok. And subscribe to me on here. What are you thinking? What are you thinking? Ew, I need to shave my legs. I always like use this really nice camera like to have good quality and then I regret it after because you can see every freaking feature and flaw. Stay tuned because really soon after this, I'm going to put the part two of my packing video. And then I have an apartment tour to come up and then I'm moving to a new city so I have to go there and bring y'all with me and edit all that and it's gonna be so much fun. I think. I think you'll like it. You might like it. You might not. If you fancy me you'll like it. That was a terrible accent. Um, I do want to try again but I'm just gonna stop. Remember to shop my Poshmark and remember to... Just remember to brush your teeth. I don't know. Remember to tell your friends you love them. Aw, that was nice. <laughs> That's kind of really sweet. Stay tuned. Love you guys. Peace. Ew, weird. I'll see y'all in my next video. Bye.